Ugh. I always forget how much I hate the smell of hotel rooms. There's either no life, or too much life, you know? You get a lungful of Febreze, or you get smacked in the face with the scent of every guest that's ever slept here. No in-between. Mm, I guess I prefer the fake lilacs to the human potpourri, but it's a tough call. Hey! Hey, Cupcake! I'm talking to you. Focus. Did you hear anything I just said? Figures. Come in already. You can't just stand in the hallway all night. We don't have much of it left as is. What's with you? You were quiet on the ride over, too. Don't tell me you're actually scared. Mm, I can smell it on you, you know? Cortisol. Adrenaline. Mm, it's gonna give your blood such a nice edge. Adrenaline's got a kick to it. Tangy. Delicious. It'll pair perfectly with your natural sweetness. <laughs> I'm sorry, love. You're gonna have to put up with a bit of creepiness tonight. It's only fair. I put up with your self-righteous attitude every time we see each other. So? Are you joining me or not? Tick tock. Night's wasting. There's plenty of space to get comfortable. It's a king size bed, after all. Hmm. There you go. Not so hard, was it? Oh, the hatred in your eyes. <laughs> Not to mention that sharp tongue. I've got a few sharp things myself, Cupcake. Mm, I am so glad to finally be introducing them to you. Now, have you given the thrall any more thought? <sighs> I can't say I was expecting anything else. Can't say I'm disappointed either. I want you to feel this, Hunter. I want you to remember every second. I want to hear your heart racing in terror as I drink you down. <laughs> uh, still with the insults. You just won't quit, will you? Maybe I should take the high road here and come back with a compliment instead. You'd hate that just as much, wouldn't you? For your information, I was actually going to say you look quite nice, all fancied up. Nothing against the old leather and weapons standby, obviously. But it's fun to see you in something else. Variety and all that. Though... I think my contribution really completes the outfit. Nothing like a fresh pair of fang marks to spice up an ensemble. Complain all you want. Seriously, do. It's fun to hear. But you're getting a second set of those in a minute. Might as well embrace the ravished by a creature of the night look. Or invest in some scarves. I don't imagine you'll want your colleagues seeing these, will you? Oh, I think it is a little bit of my business. 
After all, if you bleed and tell, I might find myself with even more of you irritating little buffies on my tail. Oh well. We'll see if you're more forthcoming after I'm done eating. Just lie back. That's right, like that. <laughs> you might want to grab another pillow to prop yourself up a bit. Oh, God. Do you have any idea what you look like right now? Mm, you are a four-course meal, darling. All laid out like that and ready for me to devour you? Mm-mm, no. Stay down. Just relax. <laughs> Don't you trust me, Cupcake? Smart hunter. Mm, good thing I don't need your trust. No, tilt your head back. Further, hunter. Don't be shy. There we go. All right, hold still. This is going to hurt quite a bit. As you already know. So brace yourself. even better than I remember. Mm -hmm. You're in the wrong line of work, Cupcake. Say the word and I'll take you on up my place in a heartbeat. <laughs> Preferably yours. <sighs> Don't be too shy to touch now. I know. It's a lot. But it's gonna be okay, Hunter. Here. Hold on to my shoulders. I'll help ground you. <laughs> Better. Good. Mm -hmm, sorry. Mm. I know it's terrible manners to talk with my mouth full, but I just can't help it. Nothing improves a good dinner like some stimulating conversation. Though, honestly, there's not much better this can get. so long. Do you know how frustrating you are, Hunter? Slipping through my grasp every time we fight? Mm, keeping me away from this pretty throat of yours? That just makes this all the sweeter. Finally, having you right where I want you. Mm. Oh, God, that was so good. Mm, and the sounds you're making. I can practically taste them. <laughs> Is it too much for you? Too painful? Are the punctures getting too irritated? Hmm. Say the word, Hunter, and I can take all your pain away. <sighs> <laughs> 
so stubborn. Even with all the strength leaving you? Don't think I can't feel your grip weakening. Could you fight me off now, if you had to? If I told you you weren't leaving this place alive? Mm. <laughs> oh, that got you tense. Your heart just about leaped out of your throat. Oh, shit. Tilt your head back up, darling. I don't think I'm through with you yet. All right, I'll do it myself. <laughs> I should lead you around by the jaw more often. It's quite fun. And the view isn't bad either. Mm. <sighs> okay. <laughs> I think that's just about as much as I can take. Any more, and you might actually die. Hmm? Oh, that. I was just teasing. Didn't I tell you I wasn't going to kill you? I keep my promises. Like, returning this stupid necklace. I'm leaving it on the bedside table here. Give Wild my compliments, will you? The metalwork is quite lovely. Even knowing what it's for. Hey, don't black out on me now. Eyes open, Hunter. Oh my god, could you look any more delicious right now? Dizzy from blood loss. Bites already bruising. I think I need a picture. <laughs> I would tell you to smile, but I'm really enjoying that half-conscious look you've got going on. Hold still. And a close-up. And one more of your neck. All right, I'm satisfied. The mini bar didn't have apple juice, but it did have orange juice. And for some godforsaken reason, Gatorade, so... Hmm? Well, of course I'm still here. You need to drink something, and I can't exactly see you standing up to get it yourself right now. I wrecked you pretty thoroughly, Hunter. <laughs> You're just too tasty for your own damn good. Which brings us back to drinks, so which one do you want? The juice is probably the better option, but... <sighs> Focus, Hunter! If you go and die on me, that means I held back for nothing. So pick a drink. Alright. Here. Here. Do you need me to hold it up for you, or are you up to drinking it on your own, like a grown-up? Good. Slow sips. You don't want to throw up. Stop looking at me like that. I take care of my meals, all right? The one's worth keeping around anyway. Obviously, if I drain someone dry, I'm not giving them a juice box and cookies afterwards. Very funny. No, I don't have any sweets with me. Aside from you. You're just gonna have to settle for whatever's on the dessert menu from room service. Let's see. Ah, chocolate cake. Hot fudge sundae. Various milkshake flavors. Something called a dessert lasagna? Sounds fucking disgusting. Ooh, slutty cheesecake bars. Is that seriously a real thing? If we don't order that, I'm going to be severely disappointed in the both of us. 
No. This room isn't exactly sunlight-proof. I'm just here long enough to get you your snack, and then I'm gonna go home to my nice cozy coffin. It'll be a bit lonely, though. Maybe I can tempt you back there one of these nights. Done with your drink already? That was fast. You're already looking a little bit better, too. You'll be back in fighting shape in no time, Cupcake. Shame. I could do a lot with a few free nights. <laughs> Aw, back to the insults already. I guess you are feeling better. Sit tight and I'll order you something to eat. Oh, and Cupcake? Thanks for the snack. I hope we can do it again sometime.